Breaking, look what just happened to the NRA. Media bias backlash, NRA memberships up as MSM propagandizes for gun control. NRA, National Rifle Association, memberships have skyrocketed in recent weeks since the mainstream media has been ramping up their anti-gun agenda. As the media continues to weaponize the news in the form of gun control propaganda, the NRA's profiting continues to go up. The Daily Mail reports that Google searches for NRA membership rose 4,900% since the Parkland, Florida school attack. That rise occurred at a time when many Democrats, media personalities, and Hollywood celebrities were denouncing the NRA and leveling blame on the association for the shooting that took 17 lives in a gun-free zone. Hollywood also took to social media to make sure they press an anti-gun agenda for the elitists as well. Notorious leftist, Chelsea Handler tweeted the following. We have to elect candidates that are not funded by the NRA in November. We have an opportunity to elect candidates who won't allow kids to go to school and get shot. It is disgusting how many times this has happened and Republicans do nothing. You all have blood on your hands. There's nothing like a little scapegoating when it comes to placing the blame for mass shootings. It seems like the blame falls always on the NRA and law-abiding gun owners, not the psychopaths who shoot up schools. CNN's February 21st gun control town hall highlighted the media's animosity towards the NRA, as it featured survivors from the Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School shooting confronting Republicans over NRA affiliation. The Guardian reported that one student spoke to Senator Marco Rubio, RFL, and asked, Can you tell me right now you will not accept a single donation from the NRA? According to The Hill, a large swath of the American populace is equating these various attacks on the NRA with attacks on the Second Amendment and gun rights in general, while others see the attacks as proof of media bias. The result is an explosion in NRA memberships. After several large corporations dropped discounts for NRA members, many took it as shots fired at the NRA for a crime they didn't commit. The Daily Mail quoted Cleta Mitchell, a former NRA board member and former Oklahoma lawmaker, who said, There is no one. No one. Who joins the NRA for a discount on a rental car. You can rest assured that the NRA will not lose a single member as a result of this. If anything, it should spur people to join the NRA as a 